Hello YouTube, I'm not so super prize and today we are back in House Flipper. I really hope you guys enjoyed the 45 minute bumper episode. That was episode 2. That was a roller coaster and a half. And I really do hope it went over well because that was a very stressful episode. We painted, we cleaned, we couldn't find dirt, I destroyed houses trying to find dirt. It was a it was a mad episode. Hopefully this episode will be a little bit more chill. Because, I mean, I remember that last episode. I think I spent 10 minutes trying to find a damn electrical socket. That still tortures me to this day. But anyway, let's get back into it. Because I am loving this game. It is so satisfying to play. So let's get back into it. Clean some more houses. And hopefully not spend half an hour looking for an electrical socket. Or dirt. But I believe there is a job where I think it was another like college students had a party so I think we'll start off with that one I think that was gonna be nice I keep saying oh this will be a nice one and then it ends up not being nice and I've got to remember when it comes to aims I need to be very specific so right let's go so uh, here we go students house to clean up so good morning I'm an elderly person and I've been renting out apartments to students for a few years now Unfortunately, this year I've had a bit of bad luck. I came across some rather uncultured tenants. They weren't paying on time, so I decided to check up on them. As soon as I entered the apartment, my jaw fell to the floor. The entire place was a mess. Energy drinks all over the place. Foil, noodles, grime everywhere. And they were just laying around the kitchen playing their computer stuff. I warned them that I'd have them evicted if they didn't pay, so they did just that. However, the money they paid me was from selling the radiators on a scrapyard. They got rid of the furniture and brought and what seemed like half the yard dump and they still had the audacity to ask for the deposit back. I'm too old to deal with the mess they made. Please, I ask that you clean it up. Alright, so this should be something a bit more straightforward. So, clean up and I think we're replacing radiators. Oh my god. Well, let's get it cleaning. So I think this one's going to be a very straightforward one. I think it's basically just mass clean up. Just mass clean up and replacing a couple of radiators. Alright, let's do this. So, right. Let's do that. So, I've got red dirt. Uh, I'm trying to remember how to play this game. Right. Any dirt? Oh, yep. Got dirt on the wall here. That's it. So, I think we'll just go room by room again. Alright, let's get rid of all these bottles. So we'll kind of tidy the room and then we'll clean. And I think I'm going to have to clean the walls. Alright, get rid of that, get rid of that. How much trash we got left? Gone to this, there's still more. Oh. And then there's a radiator we've got to replace. Um. Anything under the bed? No. Right, I don't think there's any more trash. Oh, nope, the post accounts is trash. Alright, now we're cleaning. Let's get to... Nope, not painting, cleaning. But yeah, I think this should be not too rough. Right, so window's done. Then the wall. Right, clean the window. And then, oh, we're painting as well in this. Okay. Didn't think we were painting, but we're painting as well. Right, so I'll do that. We'll mount the radiator and then we'll paint. So... We'll also neaten this up. We put that there. Right, so you can buy a radiator. Let's get a radiator. Uh, store. Installations. So we'll just look for a, a normal radiator. Perfect. 
then we're painting. So I think this will maybe go a medium pot. Right, radiator done. And we're painting with colours white. I think these are okay. Yeah. Right, so let's get some paint. So, white. Uh, perfect. Then, painting. So hopefully this won't take too long. If it's just painting one or two rooms, then that's okay. There we go, 10% done already. Gotta remember I can do two walls at once here. Oh, now we're getting through it. Flying through now. Get more. Alright, we'll get this bit. And then, oh, not there. There we go. Sorted. There we go, we're nearly half done with these walls already. So yeah, if we can kind of zip through this, then this one will be quick. I think this will be a really quick kind of map to do. Right, we're half done. I think we're going to need another can. But well, will that be a problem for future Fraz? And that problem might be in like two minutes. <laughs> there we go, we're two thirds of the weight. I think that's actually all the paint used. Yeah. Right. Another one. And we can dispose of that. There we go, painting. So if we can kind of get this room done, then that's kind of, I think this will be one of the kind of rougher rooms that we all oh, wait to them. Thought maybe I missed a bit. So it should literally just be these bits here. Unless there's maybe more they want me to do. Yeah, there's more. Like windows, maybe? Because it will not be like the radiator. Oh, there it is. I completely forgot about the bit above a window. Right. Right, then... We'll keep that white paint handy just in case I need any more. But that should be this room done. Perfect. Alright, let's go back to cleaning. Oh my god, this room's even worse. Right, let's get rid of all these bottles. Then we'll fix the chair on that later. Right, so we've got to buy another radiator. Then, oh, just this trash bag here. Come on, game. Oh, it's not going to let me get the trash bag. Right, move that chair. There we go. Right. So we're just cleaning dark, cleaning the window, and getting a radiator. So, not too bad. Let's get to work in the dark. The dark shouldn't take too long. There we go, we're 63% done. Right, it's gonna... Oh wait, what about the chairs? Right, 
Alright, Jail seems to be okay. Any more dark? Oh, yeah, up in the walls. Alright, done. Clean this window. But yeah, like, as I said, I've been really enjoying this game. It's been so much fun, and it is just super satisfying to just clean everything. Right, so we'll stick this chair over in the corner. I should know, we'll stick it in here where it should be. We just need to get a radiator. So, installations, radiator in the bottom. Um, so, I really do want to try to keep this going as a series because I am just having so much fun in this. Um, with regards to some of the other stuff, like the Biomutant stuff, I really do want to keep pushing on with because I'm quite enjoying Biomutant. And as I said, the first video, um, if you've seen that, if you haven't seen Biomutant yet, go have a look at it. Like, first episode is a bit of a rough one, but the second one felt so much better. And I thoroughly enjoyed doing the second one. So please go check out Bimey as well. So you can maybe watch it after this video. Right, we'll do yeah, let's do this bit first. So we can get rid of all the dirt. I'm trying to kinda of go a room at a time. Like I'm trying to not kinda of jump too much between rooms. Like I wanna try to get one room done and then once it's finished, move on to the next one. So just check kinda of upper walls as well. Right, going to this is... But, oh, yeah, I see it. There we go. So, yeah, just kind of check down. Because, like, there could be some, like, really hidden bits in, like, the walls. Hopefully soon I get, like, a perk point. Right, a vacuum cleaner would be so much better. But I don't have a vacuum cleaner game. You haven't given me one. Right, there should be more dirt somewhere. I'm not sure where though. Oh, in fact, is that maybe more dirt up there? Can't tell. Oh wait, we've missed a bit over here. Oh, here it is. Right, now we've got one more bit of dirt, but I have no idea where it is. Right, can I check up top? Alright, let's go in here. Right, first of all, we'll remove trash. I think as long as I can get, like, most of the dirt out of a room, I'll take it. Because I think with this game, like, you're not going to get everything. Then we'll straighten this up. There we go. Alright, let's clean this dirt. But it's also a good way for me just to kind of chill, maybe chat with you guys. Because I've got a lot of projects coming up. Um, like, particularly kind of around mid-January, I really want to kind of do a little bit of a 14 push on content. Because 6.3 is dropping soon. So I want to try and kind of get... I want to do a video on the new dungeon. And maybe even the Alliance raid. Um, I've got the Alliance raid kind of penciled in. Like, whether it happens or not remains to be seen. I think there's a bit of dirt underneath the bed. Can I clean it from here, though? Yes, I can. Then we've got a lot of dirt over here. Um, So I want to try and kind of get 14. I know 14 does tend to do really well on this channel. So I would like to try and kind of do a bit more 14 related content is just very difficult to do because like once you've kind of experienced the kind of story you can't like you can't repeat it the one thing i was considering doing was maybe like a a revisit so like i would play like a realm reborn and kind of revisit it and kind of do that so that is a possibility so i might do like a community post and maybe ask about you know, and see what people say. Right, I just want to check if there's any more hidden dirt under here. Is there? No. So, 
So I might do that. So I could do that. I think if, um, you know, I might do a community post and ask about, see what people think. If they want to see it, then I'd love to do it. Because I want to try and kind of do content that I think you guys would really enjoy. I'm just going to do a quick check and see if there's any, like, hidden dirt. Because sometimes this game can kind of hide the dirt, but according to the minimap, there's nothing. So, I guess we'll just get another radiator. But yeah, I've got Biomutant on the go, Skyrim, I'm... Skyrim's doing okay. Like, Skyrim videos are doing quite well. I kind of felt they'd do well. Um, in terms of, you know, statistics and kind of the views. Right, I think that's this room done. Let's go into this room. Right, so that's that done. Then we'll clean the dark. So we've got to do a washer and a radiator now. Right, let's get rid of all this dirt first. So, kind of in February, I'm going to, like, I know we're kind of not even, well, at the time of recording, not even in January yet. Um, but by the time this goes out, I'm probably going to be planning February. And for that, it's going to be a lot of Biomutant. Like, I really want to try to work through that game, like, and kind of keep riding that sort of wave of momentum it seems to be getting. And then, if it does continue to do well, then great, fantastic, I'm happy. Then, we'll see. I do have some other games I would like to do. Uh, up here. Um, possibly Shadow of the Colossus. Because I've had that sent at my PS4 for a long, long time. And I've just never had a chance to kind of get going on it. Right. I just want to check something. Is... I don't know if that's dark. Because I'm just kind of checking around here because there seems to be a lot bit of dirt that I have missed in here. Right, let's focus on... Right, so if we get... Radiator here and then we need a washer. So, come on. Thank you, game. So yeah, I'm pretty much kind of looking through like my games and like obviously like PS Plus games will be quite a good thing to do because that'll be really kind of easy content. All right, and we need, so we need to unscrew these and then we need to buy a washer so we can just search for that. There we go, mint the ball. Washer. So let's get this put together. Then that's this room done. But yeah, I'm pretty much... I'm also kind of opening the floor to, like, you guys, the viewers, to kind of ask what you guys would like to see. Because I want to try and kind of do more variety stuff. Like, as much as I do enjoy 14, it's a very difficult game to kind of get consistent content out of. Right, the games want me... There we go. Like, it's very difficult to do f content in 14, because once you've kind of done a dungeon, then you've everyone's seen it. Like, and I've got all my classes at 90, so it's very difficult to kind of do leveling content. Like, it would pretty much just be me doing tons of side quests, which would be a bit boring. So I might look into 14 and if there's anything that kind of jumps out at me, then I'm going to try push on with 14. But as I say, variety is more of what I want to go into. Just kind of something different. I want to try and do something for everyone. Because if I do 14 all the time, it's going to get a bit stale. Right, let's go in here. I think this is the, the biggest room. So we've got uh, remove all the trash. We've got vacuum up glass shards. So if I got a vacuum cleaner, I don't even have a vacuum cleaner. Unless I've got to buy it. I'll maybe check and see if I can buy a vacuum cleaner. I should maybe be able to. Right, I'll check just now if I can buy a vacuum. 
don't even know how to spell vacuum. <laughs> Vac. There we go. Nah. Can't buy a vacuum cleaner, so basically. I'm not gonna get everything done, so there must be another job that I need to do to get a vacuum cleaner. Although it says the last yards are picked up, so I guess if you, as long as you kind of mop or kind of hover over it, you can just get rid of them that way. So I should probably do one of the other jobs, and I get the vacuum cleaner. So get all that. Ah, there's a lot of trash in here. I knew this was going to be a rough room. Oh, wait. Pull out the vacuum cleaner. Ah, you've got it already. Right, so there we go. So it turns out you actually have the vacuum cleaner on you. So is that... Oh, no, not quite. Go. So we're pretty much just vacuuming up all these shards. There we go. Any more glass shards about? Right, let's let's clean up. I don't think we're painting in here, which is fine. But yeah, if I kind of Clean up, then I can see a bit better. Oh, come on, vacuum, please. For some reason it's not vacuuming. There we go. There's still some shards here. There we go. I don't know if I've got to, like, walk over it. Oh, there we go. So, I think I've basically just got to walk, like, over it. Right, so that's five. There we go. There we go. That's it. Vacuum in done. Right. Now we can clean the easiest part. So yeah, in terms of Twitch as well, like I really want to try and kind of get back onto Twitch. Oh, we've got a skill point. Um, this is pretty much just me kind of like trying to fill in, you know, where I can. Right, I've still got a bit of trash to remove. But I've actually been really enjoying the kind of the Let's Play videos that I've been doing. Like, in terms of, you know, stats, like they are doing okay. It's, I think it is just pretty much a case of just kind of keeping at it. Um, and also I've been doing a lot in the YouTube Shorts kind of area. And they've actually been a real, like, kind of, they've been pretty good. Like, when they've taken off, they've been fantastic. I seem to be stuck. I'm actually stuck on the table. I'm actually stuck on the table. Don't know how that happened, but that happened. So, like the shots, like the way I'm kind of been doing the shots is that I've been kind of any videos I've uploaded, I just pretty much hammer. Like, like I kind of sit and I'll just make shots here, there, everywhere, like just what I can. And most of these videos pull in, maybe. Like, I would say at best, shots wise, can pull in maybe anywhere between 5 and 10. Like, sort of between 5 and 10 shots per video. So, stuff like Skyrim tends to pull in more because that's kind of more outrageous. But even stuff like Biomutant has garnered a couple. Oh, I've missed something over here. Oh, there we go. There was more bottles up here. They were hidden. Didn't even see them. Right, that's that done. So, let's get this chair sorted. We're going to try neaten this up a bit. It's fine there. And then, we're buying a radiator. So, I need to go to store. 
So I think there's two radiators I need in here. Oh no, is it just one? So yeah, like, the shots, I'm kind of hoping that if I keep at it, the views will kind of come in quite steadily. But they've also been really good in kind of bringing in more subs. I've kind of got a few subs, like, here and there through shots, which is brilliant. Like, because I've been kind of reading up on YouTube and seeing what I could do. And I keep seeing the same thing, do YouTube shots. So I'm kind of trying to get more onto that. Right, I think we'll do this room. Next day, uh, so we need a sink and a towel radiator. Nothing to remove, so we're pretty much just cleaning. So let's give this room a good clean. See, I keep saying, oh, it'll be a nice easy job, and it ends up taking, like, <laughs> this job's been going for about 25 minutes. So it's proven to be quite a, a busy one. I thought it was probably just tidying up and mounting a couple of radiators. Turns out it's tidying up and removing a whole load of dirt. Right, there's a bit more dirt somewhere. Oh, there we go, we got it. Right, so in here we need a sink and a towel radiator. So let's get a sink. So, sink. And I've got to be careful with my words. There we go, mountable sink. Oh wait, I think I need to, yeah, I need to unscrew all that. Like, once you've unmount, like, unscrewed all that, I think then you can buy it. There we go. So, get those screwed in. And there. And then, that, the assembling is so satisfying. See, like, you wouldn't catch me doing any, like, DIY stuff, but doing it in a game, just, there is a serotonin that comes with it. Alright, taps in. Then get the pipes in. So, yeah, I think, after this room, I think I've got, like, two more. Alright, now we just need a towel radiator for here. Uh, so, installations, towel radiators down here. At least a towel radiator is pretty straightforward. But I think we've got a couple more rooms to clean, and then I think we're done. But I'm going to try to see if I can get that last perk. Oh, we've got a skill point again. Right, so we've got Handyman. So, I think we'll do both tiling and plastering. Because I think there's a job that I've not done yet that requires plastering or tiling. So, if I at least get it, then I'm ready for that. Oh, we've got a bit of trash in here. There we go. And then we'll... Straighten up the bed. Right, let's get cleaning. So, dirt. So let's get all this dirt. Hopefully, we can get everything. Oh, I've got my sign here. There we go. And then... We seem to have hidden dirt again. Chair. Is it a mirror? No. Oh, I think I see it. There we go. Right, windows. Do windows, then we've got two things to put in. See, now we're getting there. We're steamrolling through this job. Then, other window, and then we're... I think it's just the one radiator. Oh my god, this window is really dirty. It's like someone's pissed on it. Right, radiator over here. So, store. Uh, radiator. Like, see, once you kind of get going and you kind of start to get into a good rhythm, it just, like, the jobs just speed up. 
Like, and then eventually we're going to get into the big jobs, like the big houses. Oh, we can actually complete the job. But we're not done yet. I think I've still got... Yep, I've got one more room that I need to do. So it's just the living room. Like, I leave no stone unturned. Let's get rid of all these bottles. I think it's pretty much just all bottles now. So let's get every single bottle picked up. What I'll do is I'll kind of spinny that. Put that kind of round here. And then I can get into it all. Then before I finish up, we'll put this back in the corner. Right. Done. Then we'll do windows next because windows are easy. And then we're mounting one radiator here. Alright, let's do radiator. So that that's done. And then pretty much just tidying up dirt. Oh, that radiator's not wanting to go in. Is it because of this? Try it now. Oh, I did have it. Yeah. Alright, so now we just got to get this radiator in, clean all the dirt, and we're finished up. But all in all, this was not too bad a job. At least the painting was only one room. Right, now we just clean up the last little bits of dirt. Let's see if we can at least 100% this room. We're pretty much done above and beyond for this job. But that's what I want to try and do. I want to try and kind of do as much as I can in these jobs. Clean the seat. There we go. That's it. Well done. Right, we've still got a lot of dirt. And that's it. We've got everything. Everything is done. Complete the job. Oh, and we've made £3,700 for that. Nice and easy. So all in all, that was a pretty, pretty straightforward job. Nothing too crazy. And that actually, that actually took up quite a bit of time. I thought that was maybe going to be like a 10, 15 minute job. That was about half an hour. So that's actually ended up being quite a solid job. So I think with that, my friends, I think we will leave it there. We've got one more job done. So we'll have a look at the mail and see what we've got. So we've got additional walls, walls to knock down. So we'll probably do this job next because that's plastering and I need to learn to plaster. And then walls knocked down, like that's a complete flip. And then this one, um, we'll see. And then I think this one's like one of our big ones. So I think the next episode we will learn to do plastering and knocking down walls. But other than that, thank you for watching my friends. If you liked the video, if you enjoyed it, be sure to like and subscribe. And be also, watch my shots and keep an eye out. Because um, the shots are doing really well. Keep them going. And be sure to check out some other series. We've got Biomutant. We've got Skyrim coming up. And as I said, we've got the Final Fantasy XIV Heaven's Turn video. Uh, that should be up. Be sure to check that out. And next week is going to be a bit of a change up. We're going to have a couple of Final Fantasy XIV videos. We're going to have a video featuring the new dungeon. I may also have one featuring the new Alliance race, so be sure to check those out when they release. But other than that, thank you for watching, my friends. I will see you in the next one. See ya.